Yo, it happened again, bro. Yo, Drake. Yo, Drake. Yo, Kendrick. We tired, bro. We tired. The reaction channels, the people that write about music, complex, genius, academics, the shade room. We tired, bro. We tired doing this coverage of the beef, bro. Can y'all give us a give us a day off, bro? Y'all keep dropping day after day. It's good for the music. I wanted this. But yo, y'all going crazy, bro. Props to all the people covering this beef and like breaking down the, the bars and, and trying to keep up with everything going on because it's a lot of hard work, man. It's crazy. Stuff could drop at any moment. Like I was just chilling and I was like, oh, Drake just dropped. My DM started popping. Yo, yo, Drake just dropped. I had to rush home, stop what I was doing and go get this video out for y'all, man. So I'm doing this for y'all, right? Before I get to the video. A lot of y'all said I was being biased towards Drake in all my videos. I just want to say, I actually said I liked the last video, the Kendrick song. Um, what was it? The um, not one, not with us or whatever it's called. I said it was fire. Only one that I didn't like really from Kendrick was the the um, Meet the Grams because it was kind of like wasn't really directly dissing Drake, but I ain't biased towards Drake. Yeah, I like Drake. I listen to Drake more than Kendrick. But it's just, you know, Kendrick took a weird approach, but I'm not being biased or anything. If you feel that way, so be it. But let's get into this. Fuck it to the video. Help me get to 50K subscribers, man, and drop a like. Send this to your friends, man. Comment below who you think is winning. Yo, if Kendrick replies again before 12, I'm going to be so mad. Because once I finish this, I'm going to turn off my camera. If, if a song drops after I turn off my camera again, I'm going to be so pissed off. Cause that happened yesterday but let's get into this man let's go y'all i'm excited so drake dropped the heart part six which is a play on kendrick's um uh song series the heart part one two three four whatever um and he has the cover art day free who drake claims has a child with whitney kendrick's fiance and right here he has day free commenting a heart under Drake's uh guest post on Instagram. So let's get him in. Now let me see you Just let me see you All right, all right, already? Already. He started he started with a bomb. The sample. Let me see you prove it. I, just let me see you prove it. Right there, it's clever. Right there, it's clever. He's telling Drake, he's telling Kendrick, whatever you state in your songs, you better have proof for it. Let me see you prove it. That was hard already. And he ain't even say nothing yet. Now let me see you prove it. Just let me see you prove it. Oh. A prize winner is definitely spiraling. I got your fucking lines tapped. I swear that I'm dialed in. First, I was a rat, so where's the proof of the trial then? Where's the paperwork of the cabinet is filed in? Ah. 1090 Jake would have took all the walls down. The streets would have had me hiding out in a small town. My Montreal connects stand up, not far down. The ones that you getting your stories from, they all clowns. Ah. I am a war general, season in preparation. My jacket is covered in medals, honor and decoration. You waited for this moment, overcome with the desperation we plotted for a week and then we fed you the information a daughter that's 11 years old i bet he takes it we thought about giving a fake name or a destination but you so thirsty you're not concerned with investigation instead you in that venice studio it's a celebration oh my god it's true it's true it's true now let me get this straight i said it in the last video um, of Kendrick, this and Drake, that um, there was rumors going around that the information that Kendrick received was planted by Drake's team, so that Kendrick falls for it and makes a song about false information about the about the daughter. So I right hear Drake saying, "Yeah, that information we planted it, and you fell for it. You so desperate for information on me that you went straight to the studio, recorded, started celebrating early, not knowing that we knew that was coming because we planted it in the first place. If that's true, because again, just because Drake's saying it, that it's not true doesn't mean that it's not true. You get what I'm saying? We still need facts whether it's true or not. 
So whoever whoever Drake gave that information to to plant um to Kendrick, we need proof. We need proof to see who's really telling the truth or not. But I like how he, he started with that that Pulse Surprise winner is spiraling. A lot of people they put Kendrick over Drake because of the the Pulitzer Prize that he won. But that's not really that important when it comes to this music shit, cause come on, bro. What other artists in the top ten have Pulitzer Prizes? All right, that don't make you the goat automatically. So this was so far. Drake's going crazy. I like how he started it where you gotta prove it. Um, he's saying all that paperwork. You know, you call me a rat or whatever. Where's the paperwork, man? If you're gonna say something in a diss, we need the paperwork. And the same applies to Drake. Anything Drake says, we need paperwork. He he said in the other songs that Kendrick beat his his fiance. We need paperwork on that, Drake. You waited for this moment, overcome with the desperation. We plotted for a week and then we fed you the information. A daughter that's eleven years old, I bet he takes it. We thought about giving a fake name or a destination. Ah. But you so thirsty, you not concerned with investigation. Instead, you in that Venice studio, it's a celebration. Ooh. You gotta learn to fact check things and be less impatient. Your fans are rejoicing, thinking this is my expiration. <laughs> Even the picture you use, the jokes and the medication, the Maybach glove and the drug he uses for less inflation. Master manipulator, you bit on a speculation. You dumb and reactive, nigga. I'm petty with dedication. What about the bones we dug up in that excavation? And why isn't Whitney denying all of the allegations? Why mm, so he's saying like oh, everything that you had in that picture was planted. But we also gotta you gotta answer why you didn't why is Whitney, his fiance, not denying the allegations that that, that he beat her before? following day free and not miss the morale you have hold up the allegations why is she following day free and not miss the morale you haven't seen the kids in six months the distance is wild damn so she's following day free which drake alleges is her baby a baby daddy but she's not following kendrick what happened and he's saying you didn't see your kids in six months what happened let me find out he got whitney on payroll <laughs> Dave leaving heart emojis underneath pics of the child. Speaking of anything with a child, let's get to that now. This Epps Okay, so this Dave Free, the cover art is the picture of Dave Free leaving comments under the, the pictures of the kid. Okay. He's bringing up receipts, bro. He's bringing up receipts. Underneath pics of the child. Speaking of anything with a child, let's get to that now. This Epstein angle was the shit I expected. TikTok videos you collected and dissected. Instead of being on some disdirect shit, you rather fucking grab your pen and misdirect shit. My mom came over today and I was like, Mother I, Mother I, Mother I, wait a second. That's that one record where you say you got molested. Oh, fuck me. I just made the whole connection. This about the. Damn. So now he's mentioning, I forgot what song that is from Kendrick. Is this Sober Mom or Mom something where he talks about uh, being molested? Damn. He's, yo, he's going crazy, bro. Drake is going crazy so far. Oh, Mother Eye Sober. I just looked it up. Damn. It gets so depressing. This is trauma from your own confessions. This when your father leave you home alone with no protection. So neglected. That's why these pedophile raps and shit you so obsessed with It's so excessive, they acting like it's so aggressive But you just never known affection I don't want to dish you anymore This really got me second guessing Damn, so he's saying He's saying Drake is saying that, that Kendrick is only doing this Talking about child uh, molestation and all that stuff Out of, you know from his past experiences, he has PTSD from what he was talking about on Mother Eye Sober when he supposedly got molested. So he's saying that all of that is coming back, and that's why Kendrick is bringing this type of stuff up. So that's crazy. Drake, Drake's taking a crazy angle on this one. They're acting like it's so aggressive, but you just never known affection. I don't want to dish you anymore. This really got me second guessing. Touch my body by Mariah Carey play. You probably start reflecting. I never oh been with no one God. underage, but now I understand why this the angle that you really mess with. Just for clear. He said, touch my body while, while Mariah plays. Uh, wait, what he said? The song, touch my body. Run that back. Touch my body by Mariah Carey play. You probably start reflecting. Damn, you probably start reflecting. So when Touch My Body plays, he probably start reflecting. So he start having bad memories of when he got molested. That's crazy. This is disgusting, bro. 
I never been with no one underage, but now I understand why this the angle that you really mess with. Just for clarity, I feel disgusted. I'm too respected. If I was fucking young girls, I promise I'd have been arrested. I'm way too famous for the shit you just suggested, but that's not the lesson. Clearly, there's a deeper message. Deep cuts that never healed, and now they got infected. Like if Dave really fucked your girl and got her pregnant, talk about being resentment. Not sure how to ease the sentiment. The shit's too intimate. I'm praying you recover from both incidents, but you a piece of shit, so this shit really no coincidence. Drake is not a name that you gon' see on no sex offender list. Easy does it. There we go. Mentioning a minor, but niggas gotta be sharp and tell the fans who was it. You thought you left D flat, D major. Woo! That's a bomb. That's a bomb. Drake is directly replying to them lines. He's like, and I agree with Drake on this one. Because someone of Drake's stature, someone who's in the media so much like Drake, why would he do this? Like, why would he have to be with young girls and stuff like that, man? So that's why I think it's all cap. Um, people just be spreading rumors and stuff. So I, I think it's cap, but. You never know. But still, that, that bar was crazy because he's replying to the A major line. So let's run that back, man. That was crazy. Piece of shit, so this shit really no coincidence. Drake is not a name that you gon' see on no sex offender list. Easy does it. You mentioned an A minor, but niggas gotta be sharp and tell the fans who was it. You thought you let He said you mentioned an A minor. It's going back to that A minor line. So he, he's gonna come back with the musical chords. You remember in the last song, Kendrick was talking about um, Drake's B with A minor. So he he turned that into a whole chord line. I uh, mentioned in A minor, you got a B sharp. Left so D flat, D major. D, you're trying to leave D flat, but but D major. So those all musical chords. So he said, you're trying, to, you're trying to leave D flat. So you're trying to deflate me, trying to destroy me, but I'm too big for that. I'm too major. That was hard, man. Kendrick, sorry, but. He replied to that like a genius. Incidents, but you a piece of shit, so this shit really no coincidence. Drake is not a name that you gonna see on no sex offender list. Crazy. Easy does it. You mentioned an A minor, but niggas gotta be sharp and tell the fans who was it. You thought you left D flat, D major. That was crazy. I slit your throat with the razor and do Rick Ross air like that one flight from Malaysia. I'm your. He said I'll slit your throat with the razor and leave you like Rick. Leave Rick Ross flight like that one from Malaysia. So he's gonna leave Rick Ross Airlines like like that Malaysian flight missing. I know Rick Ross plane recently had a crash landing. Crazy. Your baby mama screensaver. Only fucking with Whitney's, not Millie Bobby Browns. I never look twice at no teenager. I'm a fucking hit maker, dog, not a peacemaker. Yeah, bullets that I'm stuffing in each chamber. Go ass in extreme danger. Stop buying views and buy comments. You may as well keep the paper. Shit you about to need for later. I give a fuck about your streaming data. You could. All right, let's talk about that because he said stop buying views and bot comments. We'll speak about that later. When Kendrick dropped that on the last song that he dropped, Not Like Us, people were saying that it was bots and, and stuff because Drake had dropped and he got like a certain amount of views in an hour, like 50K. And Kendrick dropped, and he got like a million or two million views in 30 minutes. The shit was crazy, bro. So, I don't know. It's a bit sus. But who knows? Who, who knows, man? Who really knows? You'll drop a hundred more records. I'll see you later. Yeah, maybe when you meet your maker. I don't want to fight with a woman beater. It feeds your nature. If you still bumping R. Kelly, you could thank the savior. Said if they deleted his music, then your music is going to a hypocrite. I don't understand oh why my these people God. are just sounding like you sent him commissary when he needs some paper. I'll see you later. Run that back. Yeah, maybe when you meet your maker. I don't want to fight with a woman beater. It feeds your nature. If you still bumping R. Kelly, you could thank the savior. Said if they deleted his music, then your music is going to a hypocrite. That's crazy. Now he's talking about, this is a really strong line in this because he's talking about how Kendrick, he said, if you bump R. Kelly, you could thank Kendrick, thank your savior. Um, Cause Kendrick a while ago said that if they delete R. Kelly's music from um, all the platforms that, that he wants his music to get deleted too. So he's kind of like, how you, Drake's like, how you talking, like trying to say I'll be with minors and stuff. If you support this guy R. Kelly that that's in jail for doing that type of thing, so so I don't know. He, he kind of killed it with that line, bro. That that's a pretty 
Rough shot right there. But crit, I don't understand why these people praise you. Sounding like you sent him commissary when he needs some paper. Album dropping soon. No wonder you turn a cloud chase instead of doing hard labor. Crazy. Nigga, I see you when I see you like Fantasia. Whitney, you can hit me if you need a favor. Ugh. And when I say I hit your back, it's a lot safer. He said, when I hit your back, it's a lot safer. So he said, Whitney, you could hit me if you need a favor. He's talking to Kendrick's fiance. So if you need something, let me know. And I'll hit you back. It's a lot safer when I hit you back because I'm just replying to your message. When Kendrick hits you back, he's actually hitting you. So he's, he's sticking with the allegations that, that Kendrick is beating on his woman. That's crazy, man. I promise. Yeah, this was hard. He's going yeah. crazy. I'm not going to lie. This shit was some, some good exercise. Like, <laughs> it's good to get out, get the pen working. You would be a worthy competitor if I was really a predator and you weren't fucking lying to every blogger and editor, but it is what it is. Fuck your shit. You definitely got this shit burnt the fuck out, though. Like, you got 10 more records to drop. The one before the last one, we finessed you into telling a story that doesn't even <laughs> exist. That's crazy. And then you go and drop the West Coast one to try and cover that up. I would like that one. That, that, that would be some shit I could dance to if you wasn't tripling down on some whole other bullshit. But. So it, it kind of makes sense if, if this is right. He drops the, the, the last song, Not Like Us, to cover up for Meet the Grams because he got finessed into that. So it's true though, when he dropped Meet the Grams and Not Like Us dropped, people forgot about Meet the Grams. So it's true that he kind of did that. You know, at least your fans are. But we need proof though. Getting we need some proof. Raps out of you. I'm happy I can motivate you, bring you back to the game, like you know. But just let me know when we get into the facts. Mm. Everything in my shit is facts. Uh. I'm waiting on you to return the favor, like. Damn. Yeah, this is hard. Can we drop a bomb for Drake real quick, man? A round of applause for Drizzy. He killed it. Yeah, this was solid. This was solid. Honestly, I think this was this was uh, a slight bomb. It was a nuclear. This was a slight bomb. This was crazy. Is he replied to all the allegations? But like I said, we still need facts. Um, he was directly replying to a lot of things that Kendrick said. And it was just simple, straight to the point. No beating around the bush. Um, not dissing anybody else besides that one Rick Ross line. But um, just like Kendrick doubled down on the Drake like in Miners line, Drake had to double down on, on Kendrick being his wife. So in my opinion, Drake's in, he might be in the lead. Because he finessed Kendrick and, and made up a lie about him having a daughter. when uh, And Kendrick fell for the bait and made a whole diss about it. So, But we don't know if that's true yet. We need receipts. But if that is true, Drake took the lead with this one, man. That's all I'm going to say. Let me know what y'all think in the comments. Who you is, Team Kendrick, Team OVO, or Team TDE, Team Kendrick? Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Uh, Shantae next to me. My girl's next to you. What, what team you on? She said whatever team I'm on. So I, right now I'm on team music, man. I'm on team music. The fans is really winning right now. So she's scared to go on camera. Sorry, y'all. But uh, yeah, we team music out here. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Road to 50K, y'all. Love y'all so much, man. Stay safe out there. This is getting interesting. Kendrick and Drake. Please take a break because I'm tired of doing these videos. Three videos a day is too much, bro. I love y'all so much, man. We out of here. Let's go.